2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. And we look in the locker room moments before this huge game. All focus on this postseason. Real tense in there. Hey, it's been an exciting series so far as we head into Game 6 in the West. I can't believe the level of play we've seen from these teams. And it's only Round 1. Our game tonight featuring the Los Angeles Clippers as they go up against the Dallas Mavericks here at their home, American Airlines Center. Welcome, everyone. Courtside with two ex-NBA stars, Grant Hill and Brent Berry. I'm Brian Anderson. We've got Allie LaForce on the sidelines tonight as well. Now the opening lineup for the Los Angeles Clippers. George and Kawhi, the talented forward pair. Norman Powell out there with James Harden. And it's Plumlee in at the center position. And for Dallas, Luka and Kyrie are the talented backcourt. Daniel Gafford is out there with P.J. Washington. And it's Exum in at the small forward position. If you look at the Mavericks, this is an elimination game for them. But they'll be in front of their home fans. <laughs> you can't underestimate how big a factor that can be. I mean, the energy in this building is going to be electric all night long. Now here's Harden. Pass to Leonard. There's the triple. And Kyrie Irving clears the rebound. Here's Washington. Basket is good. Nice setup from Irving. And here's George. He'll bring it up for the L.A. Clippers. Inside. Here's Plumley, And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. And working on that upper body strength, Plumley has a great build and is converting through contact. Puts it up from 12. And Irving gets it to go. And despite the defender's length, he goes right up from the mid-range. I don't think he sees any kind of defense when he's at that range. It doesn't matter who's guarding him. Now here's Harden. George for three. Doncic pulls down the board. And you just can't afford to give up that kind of look very often. Exum passes to Gafford. Washington. And they're going to count that bucket. And they'll send him to the line. It could be a three-point play. Up? Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. The Clippers have gone one for three so far. Now here's Jordan. Not a lot of good work there as it goes. That's a tough shot for a lot of people, but PG makes it look easy. And here's Doncic outside. Drops in the three. Are you serious? <laughs> what a sweet move. Broke his ankles on that one. Doncic against Harden. That's tipped. Stolen by Gafford. To the inside. And Irving with the basket. On the assist by Washington. Irving's got his second basket of the game. Here's Powell. Here's Plumley. Lays it in without an inch of room around him. Well, don't get surprised by that burst from Plumley. He crashes in for the rebound, has the athleticism, and finishes with authority. And they pick up two. Yeah, their offense is really humming right now. They just can't miss. Time called here. The Clippers decide to talk it over.
Now, well, if you're just tuning in, we've played about two and a half minutes here in the first. Pass to Leonard. Over Washington. Shot by Leonard. No good. I admire the play call. They just couldn't capitalize. Yeah, an efficient offensive possession. They found the look that they wanted. Just didn't go in. And the shot's good by Irving. This has been just a dreadful start for them defensively. Not good at all. Here's Harden. And he hits the jump shot. I mean, with the ball in his hands, Harden's as creative as anyone. Here's Exum. George defending. Who poked away. George with a steal. And they're pushing it up. Over Washington. And yes, it goes. Got a little English on that one. Yeah, Paul George not waiting around, wanting to get out in transition, run the floor, and become a dangerous weapon on the perimeter. Off to a great start. Five straight from the field. Washington against Leonard. Over Washington. Oh, it's blocked by Washington. Irving, the pass to Washington. And Washington powers it through. So far, they're owning both ends of the floor. We'll see if they can keep this going. Like tonight, that all the hustle plays have meant so much to this team. Now just sustain some of that energy and keep comfortable. Now here's George. Right side, Harden. Three on the clock. Gafford grabs the miss. Irving with it. Picked up by Plumley. Doncic against Harden. And Gafford gets it to go on the assist by Doncic. Boy, I like their energy coming in. <laughs> Terrific execution so far. Well, if there were four or five boxes to check in terms of the game plan tonight, they might have checked six. I mean, they're doing everything out there. Zubats, he's checked in for Plumley. Harden finds Leonard. Back to Harden to stop the run, bearing his second of three attempts. Intelligent basketball. Keep feeding the hot hand. Irving for three. Rebounded by Kawhi Leonard. And it's Leonard with the ball for the L.A. Clippers. It's a ten-point game. Kicks it to George. From behind the arc. It's good. Off the assist from Harden. George has got seven points in the game. Here's Doncic. He's in his comfort zone. Two for two to start this one. Yeah, their defense is starting to wear down. That's three straight buckets at the rim. Here's Powell. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Now Norman Powell has a lot of strength, and that time he played to it. Outside Irving. Out to the right wing. Five on the clock. And he's going for the oop here. George scanning the floor. Pass to Harden. And from the field after that one, three for four now. Yeah, and we know how dangerous Harden is from three. Timeout, timeout. You can't give him this corner spot. And Dallas calls time here. Let's give Coach credit. He's trying to find a way to squeeze the most out of every possession. Got to feel good as a coach if you make all those adjustments. Pull the right strings. That's what they love to do. For the Clippers, 
Tice is checked in for Leonard. Mann comes in for Powell. And it's Westbrook in for Harden. Outside Hardaway. There's the drive. And there's the rejection. It's George on the wing. Over Green. And George with the basket. On the assist by Westbrook. George has got nine points. Still solid with the handles. George showing the D he's still a threat. Now Green. With the drive. Count it. One for one to start the game. Those teams are hot. Woo! This is a fun one to watch. Yeah, made for TV game here. Pace is great. Scoring is coming in bunches. And both of the teams feeling confident right now. Here's Mann. Tice outside. Shot clock at six. Westbrook against Doncic. And the shot is good by Westbrook. The execution has been better lately. But do they have enough energy to pull it off? Well, they've shown both effort and will to get back into this one. But can they finish this one off? Can't let up now. Doncic, no good. Oh, can't punish the defense for leaving him open that time. That's a frustrating miss for a really steady jump shooter. Westbrook, the pass to George. It's stolen by Doncic. Zubac with the steal. George for three. Oh, and another three for the Clippers. Their ball movement on this run has been tremendous. It's led to a lot of good, clean, open looks. Green in the post. George defending. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. It was a strong move. The shot's just a little off. Throw good. Green. And the Clippers making a change here. Highlands checked in. Good on both. Now Los Angeles with it. They're on a 17 to 6 run. His man. And that one is hammered home. Now that's how you capitalize on a screen. Yeah, good positioning, too. Gave him a clear path to the hoop. Really not enough help there. Lack of communication on the backside. Great teamwork and great timing. Oh, spectacular play. Here's man. Green covering. Back to man. Fires from deep. Two shots, two makes. Off to a good start. Nice job by Russell, just not forcing anything on that play. And time Dallas out, time calls out. time here. Here's Doncic. He's got five. Pass to Lively. Here's Jones. Tice defending. Off target from outside. The Clippers in the lead. Westbrook, that's good. 
Westbrook's gotten a second bucket on the night. So challenging for anybody, not just guards, to match Westbrook in his physicality. They get it back. Lively. And he dunks it down. He turns the offensive board into a big slam. Wow, he was so well positioned there. Credit his anticipation. And the shot is good by Westbrook. Westbrook's gotten his third basket of the night. Just the way he can contort, control, and focus. Amazing with Westbrook refusing to give in to the defense on that play. Down low. Here's Highland. And count the basket. He was fouled, and he's going to the line for one more. All right, guys, what do you think about the hustle stats for the Clippers? Yeah, they're just attacking on defense, getting those hands out and knocking the ball free. I really like their energy defensively. Well, they've done a great job tonight of getting out in transition, so that focus on fast break adds to your total in a hurry. That one misses for Highland. Dallas has gone two of five from deep. Hardaway, the pass to Green. Sinks that one from the post. Green's got six. So many different offenses that Tim Hardaway Jr. has played in. But he's trying to improve in his on-court awareness. A good show of it there. Now here's Highland. That one's good for two. And the Clippers lead by five. <laughs> this run has been fueled by their Matador defense. Jones, the pass to Lively. Doncic outside. Drills it from deep. Give him eight. Not just the accuracy in the quarter, it's his movement and the energy that's getting him on this nice roll. One second separating the shot clock and the game clock. Westbrook against Doncic. Six to shoot. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Russell Westbrook just out there and focused, trying to find ways in which he can help out his team to secure any win. And he makes the first. Can't hit the second. Paul George. He's feeling it tonight. He's been the driving force for Los Angeles. He made a big impact, scoring 12 points in the quarter. Back after this. Welcome back to 2K Sports, everybody. This game six getting started. And let's quickly break down the game we've seen from the Clippers guys. Well, you have to love their activity level at the defensive end. Racking up those steals. You know, they really made a lot of good quality reads down there. Took some chances, but feeling more calculated than risky. So here are the five for the Clippers to start the second. We've got Mason Plumley. Bones Highland out there with James Harden. Then it's Norman Powell, and it's Leonard in at the power forward. Powell's shot is off. The Mavericks trailing. Here's Exum. He's scoreless. Irving, the pass to Washington. Basket is good. Nice setup from Irving. I think the defense has more concerns out there on the floor, and they give him a good open look from the perimeter. For three, Powell hits the trifecta. Powell's got his second basket of the night. And how about Powell just coming back and taking on the challenge, answering the call. Gafford passes to Washington. Here's Exum. Powell covers. Poke loose. And stolen by Leonard. Pass to Highland.
And here's Harden. Just five to shoot. Puts up a three. Oh, and another three for the Clippers. A lights-out three-point shooter. Harden loves to take and make them. And there's the call on Mason Plumley. That's his first foul of the game. Paul George, he's checked in for the Clippers. Washington right side. Tipped away. It's stolen by Leonard. And it's Harden. That time on the assist by Leonard. And it's an eight-point Clipper lead. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Here's Irving. That's basket number six in eight tries. Uh, when Kyrie's going like this, he completely takes the game over. What a player. Harden from outside. Offensive rebound. And he drops the first. Well, it's been tough with all the injuries, but Kawhi is a top 75 player, rightfully so. I cannot question his greatness. And it's hard to not think about the what ifs with him. And Leonard drops them both. He's making the most of every trip to the line, providing for his team. Irving looking around and play stops a whistle there on what looks like an illegal screen. This is one where the second foul is probably going to cost you some minutes in this game. Doncic has checked in for the Mavericks and the Clippers making a change here as well. Zubats he's checked in for Plumley. Here's Leonard. Leonard doesn't hold back. And you don't want to give Kawhi that kind of positioning. He doesn't waste good looks. Timeout time time on the out. floor. Mavericks. Well, they've been turning that ball over way too much, and they really need to address this if they want to win this game. Huddle up, boys. And here's Doncic. Give him eight. Washington up top. Pass to Gafford. Washington outside. Just five on the clock. Back to Gafford. Shots blocked. Terrific defense from Zubats. His team relies on him to help alter shots. Here's Leonard. Yes. And a nice assist from Harden. And now it's a 12-point Los Angeles lead. It took a little bit of time, but now he's taken the pen off the cap and Putting his mark on this game. Oh, Luca playing grown man ball inside. The size and strength of Doncic can go overlooked. I mean, he's more than capable of scoring there in the paint. Here's Leonard. And he converts the layup. Leonard's got eight here in this quarter. You're not going to get stops against him unless you give an effort. Doncic passes to Gafford. Over Zubox. It's deflected. Leonard finds Powell. Here's Harden. That's basket number six in eight tries. Looks like we're starting to see a pattern here. Not afraid to get in the paint and get wet. 
Pass to Irving. Here's Exum from deep. Buries it from three. Well, Irving is an excellent facilitator. He's going to have those big openings. He'll take advantage. George passes to Harden. Ooh, now seven for nine after that make. <laughs> you know, they're really being bullied right now defensively. Eight of the last ten points have come from inside. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot and will go to the line. Los Angeles has gone two of three from beyond the arc so far in the second. Powell outside. Here's Zubac. And the Clippers again with a bucket. He means business. Unlikely to be a comeback on his watch. Well, he's grabbed a tee and a blanket because he's putting this one to bed. Here's Exum. He's got six. Throws it up high. And out of bounds. The Clippers will take it. Yeah, that's a tough one. An experienced player in the pro game shouldn't be making that pass. A different look for Dallas. Jones, he's checked in for Gafford. And Hardaway is subbed in for Exum. And a switch here also for the Clippers. Westbrook, he's checked in for James Harden. And the Clippers call time here. And it's Powell with the ball for the L.A. Clippers. Lays it up and banks it in. Powell's got five points now in the quarter. Excellent work from Powell in the pick and roll action. Hardaway, the pass to Lively. The defense there doing whatever they can to protect the rim. Two shots. No good on that one. Tice is checked in for Los Angeles. Man comes in for Powell. No good on the second free throw, so 0 for 2 there. Man, the pass to George. Releases. Here's Zubac. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. <laughs> They're really working the paint now. Part of a dying breed, let's say. Avica Zubats is a traditional five. Is that okay? We can say that, right? Lives in the paint and not on the perimeter. Now here's Jones. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Jones has got his second bucket on the night. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Man, the pass to Zubats. 
Fires the three. And that one's good. Man. Man's got eight points. And nice dime from Zubats. His floor awareness is solid. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. Los Angeles has gone three of four from outside so far in the second quarter. Here's George. Soft touch off the glass. He's got 14. Just tough shots just don't bother Paul George. So smooth with it when he gets into his motion. The pass, the catch, the slam. What a clean play. Man, absolutely jaw-dropping. Now here's George. 14 points for him. Pass to Zubats. Great start so far. Three of three in this one. Nice job by Zubats using his size and just making his presence felt. Here's Irving. And it's Dallas scoring again. And his fantastic performance from the last game has carried over to tonight. And the coach pretty smart for zoning in on him and giving him opportunities to stay with that confident play. Sinks it from distance. George has got five points now this quarter. Man, he is in the zone right now on offense, guys, building off that efficient first quarter. Irving for three. Here's Lively. And that one makes him two for two. He's in his rhythm. And hard work on the offensive glass. You can see the coaching staff rise up and clap for that effort. Here's Westbrook. Pass to Tice. It's blocked. To the paint. And up the court they come. The Mavericks on the break. They feel like Tim Hardaway Jr.'s role is to be out there and gun away. So ready to shoot that time. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. And things are always changing throughout a game. Teams have to adjust on the fly. And timeouts are a wonderful opportunity to just settle in and recollect the thoughts of your entire team. Not just the guys playing, but the entire team. And the Mavericks making a change here. Green is checked in. Plumley's checked in for the Clippers. Highland comes in for Paul George. Tice passes to Westbrook. Back to Tice. From outside the arc. Lively grabs the miss. Lively's got six rebounds now in the game. That one goes in. Hardaway's got seven points for the quarter. They're finding ways to get the ball into the paint. Five consecutive buckets. Here's Highland. And again, it's the Clippers missing. That's yeah, pretty much the only way to keep him from taking advantage of you down low. You've got to play tough, physical defense. They've now had assists on each of their last three buckets. And the Clippers have possession. They led by as many as 18. Man. And that one comes off the assist by Westbrook. Westbrook's got five assists in the game. Uh, Westbrook more and more becoming a lethal distributor. Three on three. Here's Mann. He's guarded by Irving. And he gets the bucket. Mann's got 12 points. 
adds to their lead. They've been able to rely on him all night. Pass to Hardaway. Again, Dallas. And they had early success from the perimeter, but I don't understand how they've gotten away from that here in the second. Here's Westbrook. Sinks another one. He's on a roll, starting four for four. So active to score from a number of spots, but when Westbrook gets to the inside, he can do damage. Robbed. There's 45 seconds left in the first half. Yeah, we're not used to seeing him get bottled up like that. Wow. Step back and fire. Another one falls for Dallas. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. Man, the pass to Westbrook. Over Irving. Westbrook, that's good. 11 points in the game. And Russell doing a great job just reading the floor that time. And knocks down a mid-range jumper. And that one's good. Irving. Yeah, he's leading the charge for them. But let's be honest, he needs more help if they're going to get out in front. Yeah, doing anything he can right now to get his team to cut into this lead and give them a chance. And so it's the Los Angeles Clippers. Up 15 points as this quarter concludes. Building this lead up in large part because of how well they're shooting it. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Thanks so much, guys. Zoo, a strong first half for this team. What was the mindset that gave you guys the lead? We just had to be ourselves, you know, just be ourselves, move the ball, place the unselfish, and uh, we're going to get ourselves an offense. Stay true to you, guys. Thank you, Allie. Good stuff. We will be right back after this break for the beginning of the third quarter. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Round one action of the playoffs continuing on 2K Sports. Glad to have you with us for the halftime show. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jeff Smith. Well, for the Clippers, they've come out tonight and put the hammer down. They're obviously anxious to finish the series right here and now and not leave anything to chance with a game seven. Kenny, what would you think about the Clippers? They're getting everything they could ask for at the perimeter. Finding open shots, making the defense look foolish, honestly. You don't like to say that, but that's what they're doing. But that defense has to adapt. The threes will just keep coming down if they don't. And Shaq, what do you have to say about the Mavericks? They've been struggling to get shots in general, but down low, they've been taking this off. They can say it. Giving up way too many easy looks. If they can't protect the rim more effectively in the second half, it's going to be a long ride home. And now with the second half about to get underway, let's send you back courtside. See everybody with Kevin Harlan. Great to have you with us again as we return to our coverage of round one. Well, you look at Kyrie Irving in this game. He's been everywhere. Yeah, we had a feeling he'd step up in this one. So far, playing at the top of his game when they really need him. Still interesting to see if in this second half he can find ways to get to those same spots. And thanks for sticking with us as this round one game continues. They've got Kyrie Irving. Washington out there with Daniel Gafford. Then it's Tim Hardaway, and it's Exum in at small forward. That's the lineup in the game for Dallas. And Irving used to having to score through contact. Great poise from the bet. On the wing, Harden. Back to Powell. Over Irving. And again, it's the Clippers. They're going old school out there now. Working the mid-range part of the floor. Pass to Gafford. Two points. That one goes. Gafford's got his second bucket of the night. <laughs> A great move. I mean, the defense has no response. Well, just ripping through right there as he finds the open spot and gets right through their high basketball IQ play. He drops yet another dive, just facilitating this offense like a maestro. And he makes it. 
Gafford's got his third bucket of the night. Three straight buckets to start the half. This is how they wanted to come out and execute. Here's Plumley, And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. And the defender tried to foul before the shot went up, but Plumley with the strength and power to earn the trip to the free-throw line. Luka Doncic has checked in for Hardaway. Paul Let's George, stop. he's checked in for Los Angeles. Right around a minute and a half played in the third quarter. Pass to Gafford. Here's Exum. Doncic outside. Now Washington. Six on the shot clock. Oh, Leonard with the block. Wow, the claw doing what he does best, using that length on the defensive end. Count that bucket. Well, I'm not sure what the coach said at halftime, but whatever it did, it's lit a fire. They're now four of four from the field to start their offense here in the second half. Irving, the pass to Gafford. Over Plumley, and Gafford gets it to go on the assist by Irving. Irving's got six assists here tonight. Irving against Powell. Over Irving, and again, it's the Clippers. And right now, that's five buckets in a row. Looking like a well-oiled machine coming out of the break. Pass to Washington. Three-pointer off the mark. For Los Angeles, they've gone an impressive 5-of-5 five five so far in the third quarter. Up top, George. He's guarded by Irving. Leonard for three. Oh, my goodness! Shot's good. He'll go to the line with a chance at a four-point play. P.J. Washington picks one up. Zubats, he's checked in for Plumley. What's up? The Mavericks have gone four of six from the floor in this third quarter. And Dallas calls time here. They're just giving away a run right now. The question is, can they stop the tie? It's hard to say right now. At this point, I've seen the coaches run through two or three iterations of defense. Is there a fourth? I'm not sure. Doncic passes to Washington. Back to Doncic. Ooh, coming through again. Shooting five for seven now. As always, Doncic attracts a lot of attention. Makes a lot of tough shots with hands in his face. Pass to George. It's good. And the assist that time from Leonard. Leonard's got his third assist of the night. <laughs> and they've come out of halftime really on a roll. Here's Doncic, and Doncic with the chance. And how about the handles Luka has? Phenomenal at creating scoring opportunities for himself. Harden, the pass to Leonard. That one falls. Leonard's got nine points here in the second half. And just totally relentless, only increasing the intensity level. Yeah, he's the guy that you want to go to right now trying to put this one away. Here's Exum, and you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance at a three-point play. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Yeah, the coach over there just asking for one simple thing, and that's some effort. Got burned on that one. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for the Clippers. 
Well, you got to give them credit for how aggressive they've been on defense, getting the opposition to cough it up and then making them pay on the other end. Well, if we add another thing to it, it's about the urgency they've played with. I mean, you look at the eyes of these guys. They're focused, wanting to get up tempo, and that's helped them score on the fast break. And it's Powell with the ball for the L.A. Clippers. Driving in. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Powell's got six here in the quarter. Well, Norman Powell is big and strong and stocky, so if he gets in that gap, he's like a bowling ball. He can take a hit. Gafford passes to Irving. Down to five on the shot clock. Doncic outside. Takes the three. And good. Coming on the assist by Irving. Irving's got assist number eight now on the night. Harden against Doncic. Here's Leonard. Over Washington. And again, it's the Clippers converting. Yeah, Leonard can do this. He can just take over a game offensively. Outside Irving. Back to Doncic. Fires the three. That one falls. Eight of ten and scoring with confidence. And he's been terrific tonight. And with a little help from the other guys on the floor, they might be able to turn this game around. And Subots with the basket on the assist by George. George has got his fifth assist in this one. And he lobs it up top. And the dunk by Gaffers. You know, the instincts of Luka Doncic are second to none. Such a natural playmaker. Harden with it. Irving picks him up. And Gafford with the block. Pass to Washington. And the dunk by Gafford. B.A., the one-hand dunk just looks so fluid. Yeah, absolutely. Even smooth when he's powering at home like that. Now a timeout called by the Clippers. You could really see his squad was losing steam. Smart timeout to give them a breather. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Now here's Highland. He's got five. Sweet little floater. Highland's got seven points. When the player gets a feel for that floater, it can really make things tough on defenders. You're just not sure how to guard them and where your point of commitment is. Here's Lively. Clock at six. Doncic passes to Washington. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. The biggest lead of the game was 24 points. Pass to Highland. Over Doncic. That one a tad offline, but it drops in for him. Highland's gotten four this quarter. Man, that's now 10 straight points in the paint. I'm not sure what's happened to their defense, man. And the officials will call the illegal screen here. You can get away with one once in a while, but it looked like he wasn't completely set on that pick. Yeah, a quick little lean like that is going to get the ref's attention. Foul call. Hardaway's checked in for the Mavericks. And the Clippers making a change here as well. Plumlee's checked in, and the shot goes in. George has got 22. A PG playing behind the pick and roll, able to use his size. A pretty good decision that time with the basketball. Jones finds Hardaway. The shot no good. Ooh, good D by Plumley. Here's Leonard. 
Rebounded by Green. And it's Green with the ball for Dallas. Here's Hardaway. Lays it up and in, despite excellent defense. Hardaway's got 11. Hardaway Jr. committed to get inside on that particular play, locked in and shrugging off the defense. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. Well, I know they don't have mobile devices out there for texting, so they might as well talk to one another. But that play never gets old. The pick and roll will still be an offensive staple 100 years from now. Trust me. Pass to Plumlee. George against Hardaway. Here's Highland. And it's good. Off the back of the rim and in. 11 points in the game. Dallas has gone 7 of 14 from the perimeter in this one. Doncic passes to Lively. That one falls. Great setup by Doncic. Doncic has got his fourth assist in this one. Pass to Plumley. Now here's George. Goes back up, and that's two points on the layup. George has got 26 points. And George has a way of sniffing out those offensive rebounds. I like when he takes that kind of initiative. Right side green. Again gets it to go. He can't miss. Five for five. Their spacing isn't quite as good as it was in the first half. They may need to hit more threes to stretch that defense. They get the rebound. Tipped. Outside Jones. And that one drops. Jones has got eight points. That's the kind of passing you want there. Work the ball around. Keep it moving. Try to get an assist on every bucket. Highland. And it's good. Off the back rim and in. And the Clippers lead by 21. I mean, the stroke looks good. He's moving well out there. What a sensational start to this game. Perfect from the field. Hardaway against George. Hardaway's shot is good. Hardaway's got four points in the quarter. These defenders really need to man up, particularly in the lane. Highland, the pass to man. Here's Leonard. Jones with the block. Here's Green. And it's hammered home by Green. Just knifing his way to the rim. He looked practically unstoppable on that play. Here's Highland. He gets it. He's seven for eight and really going at him out there. Yeah, he's been having his way this quarter, attacking the basket and protecting their lead. Two seconds separating the shot clock and the game clock. Jones from outside, and he drains it. A solid five for six now. You can tell Doncic trusts his teammates. He'll get them looks and doesn't insist on doing everything himself. George outside. Had it fallen, but it is offline. And as we end the third quarter, a double digit deficit will make it tough to come back. The Clippers on top, up by 16. We'll get right back to the action when we return. And it's time now to bring you our State Farm Assist to the Game. To talk about painting a magnificent picture with that dime, just a great decision and a perfect delivery. Yeah, those are the kind of plays that you want to put on a canvas. Just beautiful basketball. Thanks for joining us again for round one of the NBA playoffs. And on the floor for the Clippers here in the fourth. Kawhi and Zubats make up the front court. James Harden out there with Russell Westbrook. And it's Powell in at the three. One of the most creative offensive talents in the game. Harden simply just has a knack for creating contact. Shooting two. First one falls. 
and one of the most prolific offensive players of his era, James Harden. The Beards led the league in assist and scoring, and very few guys can say that. Harden hits them both. And really strong at the line since the break. Mavericks shooting an unbelievable 80% from the floor. Wow, what a performance. Here's Exum. Tries to save it. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Leonard. Four on the clock. Launches it. And the Mavericks, another three. Got to be a little bit more aggressive defending him from that range. He can be dangerous. Leonard passes to Zubat. And the shot's good. Love how Leonard slices passes through the defense. He guts the defense pretty quick on that pick and roll. Pass to Jones. Washington outside. They get it again. And the dunk by Gafford. Just great energy on the offensive glass. That's exactly how you cut into a lead. Boy, a slam like that is sure to give him a spark. Now here's Leonard. Over Washington, and good, as it takes a nice bounce off the right iron and down. Kawhi, such a threat from the mid-range. As soon as he gets to that area, it's all systems go. And he lobs it up to the rim. Up high, and down it goes on the lob. <laughs> the pass, the catch, the slam. What a clean play. Man, absolutely jaw-dropping. Now here's Leonard over Washington. Here's Zubats. Second chance shot, and he comes up with a bucket. Guys, he can't miss. I swear, he was trying to miss that. He did not miss. That means he can't miss. Doncic has checked in for the Mavericks. One shot. And Doncic has got the ball here for the Mavs. Here's Exum. Doncic outside. Five to shoot. The three from Washington. And the Mavericks, another three. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Powell outside. Outside Harden. And they waste no time getting those three points back. Harden's got five points now in the quarter. Now, you know Harden wants to utterly own the arc. He just won't let threes go unanswered. Ooh, lots of contact on the shot. So two free throws will follow that whistle. First free throw is good. And Doncic is a walking triple-double threat. His versatility and confidence is really special. He's perfect from the line this time. We're in the final quarter play here. Three minutes in. Leonard looking around. And that one, good. Leonard's got 23. Kawhi like a, a robot out there just shrugging off the contact. Beep, boop, pop, pop. Harden against Irving. Over Harden. And that one's good. Irving, 23 points in the game. Yeah, I just don't think that Kyrie gets bothered by anybody that's up in his airspace. Such a good look there. Here's Westbrook. Hey, he's now six for six. He is cooking right now. Dallas has gone two of two from outside so far in the fourth. 
Here's Exum. Powell covers. Outside Irving. And the Mavericks. Another three. One this half. Two for the game. Staying active from beyond the arc. Here's Westbrook. And the officials whistle a foul on the shot. The bucket is good, and he'll go to the line. Well, body and control isn't just for your shampoo at home. It's right there in Russell Westbrook. He gets fouled and still converts. Find the lane. Find the lane. One shot. And the free throw, no good. Dallas has gone three for three from downtown in this fourth quarter. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. First one falls for him. They're doing some good work at the line this half. And so Washington nails both of them. The Clippers have gone 7 of 8 in this fourth quarter. Westbrook, that's good. And the Clippers lead by 17. And ring the bell right now. This is a five alarm fire as Russell has it going. And it's going to be hard to douse this flame. And Irving gets it to go. Irving's got nine points now in the second half. His arrow's been trending up as of late. And he's been magnificent tonight. And the basket by Westbrook. Very little resistance around the rim right now. That's the fifth straight bucket they've given up in the paint. Exum passes to Gafford. Washington outside. Zubac with the steal. Here's Leonard. That's good. And so Westbrook with the assist. Leonard's got 25 points in the game. Doncic against Westbrook. Over to the left wing. Back to Doncic. The three from Washington. Offensive board. Gafford using his post moves to get the two points. <laughs> this guy has been wreaking havoc out there the last couple games. You saw it by that putback there. He is just completely locked in. We're getting full contributions from him right now. I love this game plan. That's 10 points in a row from in close. Mind the lanes. Mind the lanes. One shot. Here's Doncic. To the middle. Here's Gafford. And the dunk by Gafford. He may give up a little size, but has the bounce to hold his own. Here's Westbrook. Oh, it's pure again. He's now a perfect 10 for 10 in this one. And he's carried them this quarter. A dominant offensive stretch. Pass to Exum. Down low. Stolen by Harden. Here's Powell. That one's good. Seven for ten now. Great determination as Norman Powell just shook off that bump. And here's Doncic. He'll bring it up for the Dallas Mavericks. Here's Exum. And there's the foul. It's on Ivica Zubac. That's his third foul so far. And there's just one foul now away from the penalty. And the Clippers making a change here. George is checked in. Doncic left side. Gets it to go. He's now 9 for 11 on the night. At about 230 pounds, Doncic is a low down low. And here's Westbrook from the arc. Oh, and another three for the Clippers. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. And yeah, the coach over there just asking for one simple thing, and that's some effort. Got burned on that one. Here's Exum. 
Doncic outside. Sends it home from three-point land. Doncic has got 17 points here in the second half. Pass to Leonard. Over Washington. And again, it's the Clippers converting. And herein lies the problem with trying to defend Leonard, his versatility. You take one thing away, he hurts you with another. Here's Irving. Shot clock at five. Fires from the wing. And that one off the back of the rim and in. Washington's got seven now in this quarter. Pass to Zubats. Now here's George. Powell outside. And here's George. That one doesn't drop. To the inside. Gafford. And the dunk by Gafford. Not getting old here. Seeing him make that lead pass with perfect timing. Powell outside. Here's Zubats. Pass to Leonard. And there's a three-second violation. Harden, he's checked in for Los Angeles. Dallas has gone four or five from beyond the arc here in the fourth. Doncic passes to Lively. Here's Exum. George defending. Doncic outside. Shot clock at six. The three from Washington. It's rebounded by Zubats. Zubats has got his sixth rebound on the night. Harden against Doncic. Harden, the pass to George. It's good. Off the assist from Harden. George has got 12 points here in the second half. And George, a volume three-point shooter. He possesses outstanding confidence and leans into that perimeter game. Pass to Exum. Outside Irving. And there it is for him. Irving's got 30 points. One of the more skilled offensive players that is on the floor here tonight. Not an easy fella to hold in check. These guys really stepped up and played their hearts out to finish the series on their terms. So it's going to be on to the next round for the Clippers. Man, they were in a groove from long range tonight. Yeah, they were able to find space, and they were ready to let it fly the moment they saw an opening. And they shut the door on the series, taking it 4-2. The big key for them, avoiding Game 7. You always want to close it out before one of those. And as it was happening, as it was building, you knew this was a monster game for Paul George. It felt like there was more than one of him out there tonight. He was involved on every possession, and he made his presence felt in so many ways. Here's Doncic, following the score by the Clippers. Pass to Irving. The Clippers grab the miss. Well, the defense was right up on him, so electing to go for the fadeaway there to create some room, well, that makes sense. Powell with it. They've won it. Next stop, conference semifinals. And with this win in game six, they've won the series. They've got to be happy to be moving on. And it was a competitive series for sure. One that they can build off of moving forward. Well, now we have some time to check in with Allie LaForce. Allie. James, I'd love to know whether it's scoring, playmaking, or your defense, what aspect of your game are you most proud of? Being able to play a full course of a game and, uh, you know, and make an impact every single play. Uh, that's what I'm here for, and uh, that's what I have to do. It's been fun to watch. Allie, thank you as always. And that about wraps it up from here, folks. We hope you've enjoyed our broadcast of the NBA's Western Conference quarterfinals. Alongside Brent Berry, Grant Hill, and Allie LaForce, this is Brian Anderson with our entire 2K crew thanking you for watching. So long, everybody.